guys, welcome to today's video. Today I thought I would do a monthly favourites video from February to this month, March. Yes, that's right. <laughs> um, and I thought I would show you guys what are my favourite items at the moment and just take you through why they're my favourite, etc, etc. I've seen so many YouTubers do this and I love the idea of it and I thought it would be fun for me to make one myself. So sit back, enjoy. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, I'll attach my handle below. Let's get started. So my first favorite is actually an outfit that I bought more recently. I bought it, I think back in the beginning of January and I have been obsessed with it ever since. The jeans are probably more my favorite than the top, but I love the outfit together. It's super cute and I just thought I'd show you that. So this is kind of like the top. I'll give you kind of a bit more of a close up. So that's the top. It's just this really, really lovely, rich kind of purple color and I'm, I am obsessed with it. And then the sleeves are really long on my arm. I love that because it covers my hands and it's really cold over here at the moment. So that's perfect for me. And then it's got really lovely detailing on the wrist with the four gold buttons and it's stunning. I'm, I love it so much. It's a bit lightweight, so you can layer it, which I really, really like about it. And I have a lot of turtlenecks at the moment, so this one's not a turtleneck. So I really love that it gives me a bit like I can wear a scarf with it as well. So cute. And these are the jeans. These are also from Zara. They are the baggy ones, so they're not skinny jeans and I love them. <laughs> they're so comfy. They're such a good alternative if you don't want a really skinny look and they're really in at the moment. They're high waisted as well, which I really, really love. And they're just really cute. They're just that faded blue wash denim, which I think is really, really classic. I love that they've got the belt hole and big pockets in the back. Super cute. Love, love, love. I might show you guys all my clothes first and then just kind of go in section order so clothes shoes like accessories blah 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 so the next item that I have I've worn it a lot on Instagram recently it's also from Zara and it's this gorgeous houndstooth top and it's just and it's a turtleneck as you can see and it's just oh I wear it it's like one of my most worn items at the moment it's just so lovely and it's not really thick but it's like it's just oh it's just divine. And it's like, it's not tight fitting either. It's a bit looser, it's looser through the sleeves. It can be worn as like over the top, like I could wear it over this quite easily. Oh, I just, I love it. Look at it. Oh, it's just so lovely and it's so, it's just cozy and it's comfortable and it doesn't cling to you, but it like has that nice blanket feel to it. And it's just, it's houndstooth, it's classic, it's just, Oh, to die for. Absolute die for. Okay, so the next favorite of mine is the Gymshark Vital Seamless Collection. I have this collection in two colorways. This color, which is I think the dusky pink mall, and then also back in Australia, I have the indigo mall as well is by far one of my favorite gym outfits. It is just, it's so breathable. It's, it's so form fitting. It molds to your body. It feels like you're wearing nothing. And it's just, it's so, so comfortable. But like a little bit more of a softer feel. It's just, it's so soft and it's just so, so lovely. I love that the top has the thumb holes and I love where it sits on my body. It sits kind of like just um, below kind of where the sports bra ends and then the tights are really cute as well I feel like the pink and the purple are by far my favorite colors I'm so so happy I got them both they're both a bit more on the bright side but that's kind of what I like to wear when I'm in the gym I don't really like to wear black like black pieces are like staple and I love them but like you know, this kind of set is just, it's so cute. Like there's just nothing beats it. <laughs> I feel myself at this set. <laughs> from 
Natasha from the Whitney Simmons collection. I got these joggers in the beautiful blue colour and they're just, oh, they're gorgeous. These joggers are just sensational. The pocket's so big, they're so slouchy and they're just, oh, they're so comfortable. They've kind of like got a little, they've got like a little cuff at the bottom and they're kind of tight and they kind of come just above your ankle so they're kind of a bit more like ankle biters so I really really like that because I'm a bit on the shorter side so they're a bit more full length for me but they're just oh they're so comfortable and I love the lines and the details and it's just oh it's just gorgeous got the little gold Whitney Simmons right there and the thick waistband the waistband's probably my favorite part it's kind of got like that kind of like paper bag kind of waistband but then it's just Got the lovely white which I think complements the blue and the pockets are phenomenal. It's got the it's a beautiful day to be alive. Oops. Beautiful day to be alive. Quote around the ankle and it's just it's so cute and it's so comfortable. I just I love. <laughs> down the leg and they've got the clasps and the adidas logo down the bottom they're super cute you could wear them kind of like mid-rise or you could probably wear them a bit more high rise they've got zip pockets i kind of wear it in the middle kind of like just below my belly button where i think is the most comfortable and then they're just lovely they're a bit too long for me but they're so comfortable and they're just so oh they're just so lovely again i love them i wear them all the time I don't always show these ones just because I feel like they're a bit more my at home athleisure kind of clothes, but I just, I'm obsessed with them as well. So these next tights are a little bit more out there and if you love animal print, these ones are really for you. These are from Cotton On Body. They are a gorgeous leopard print. They've got like in that swimsuit kind of material and they are just lovely. They are seamed leggings, so they do have seams on them. So if you're not about that life, these are probably not for you, but they're so cute. They've got a lot of movement in them. I do find they slip down sometimes, but I just, I love them so much and they're squat proof and they're just like a second skin and they're just so, so, so gorgeous. The high waistband is high. It doesn't have pockets even though it looks like it does. And then it's very flattering on the booty as well. It's got these lovely lines that kind of go downwards a little bit so it kind of looks like you've got a bigger booty than you actually do, which is great in my case because no, it's not that big. And so my next piece is this beautiful pink uh, vest puffer jacket by Spooks Ride in Australia. I completely adore it. Haven't been able to wear it for like a year because it's been in the UK and I've been in Australia, but I love it and it's just, it's so warm and it's so lightweight and it's Pink is my favorite color. I'm just obsessed. It's got the little zippy pocket. It's got the little emblem right there. And then one of my favorite parts about it is the back. The spooks on the back. Super cute, super comfortable. I wore this in my last dressage lesson last Saturday and it was just, it was so good. I didn't get to cotton it. I was able to move my arms and I was just, it was just so good. It's just such a good staple. I think it's really, really good to have like a staple kind of like vest puffer jacket when you're riding, especially over here. I've noticed that it's ha it's a lot more common than in Australia, but this is just such a cute staple and it's a little bit of a pop of color if you're wearing all black and it's just, 
Stiller is so lovely. I'm obsessed. Say obsessed a lot, but this is a famous video, so obviously. <laughs> okay, so next up, I have my favorite pair of boots at the moment. I have never owned any Doc Martens before, and oh my God, I did not realize what I was missing out on. And I decided to get these super cute platform ones. Um, and they've got the zip on the side, so it's really, really easy. Really, really easy to put them on. It's got the yellow kind of stripy laces with the black shoe and then the yellow um, stitching around the bottom. And oh my God, they're so cute and they're so comfortable. Um, I can't stop wearing them. They're just, oh, they're adorable. I love them so much. I love them. <laughs> from beauty and skincare and I think I'll start with my beauty items that are absolute favorites I've been using it for years um, and that is Rihanna's Fenty Beauty range the two items that I have chosen to talk about are two of her matchsticks so I've got the concealer in the French vanilla um, which is just so amazing on my skin tone I don't think I've had a concealer blend out for me, personally, quite as well as this one. And as you can see, it's very well loved. It's not got much left in it. I'm due for a new one. Um, but it's just insane. It covers everything up so well. It covers my bags up so well. Um, it works better over foundation, but it does work over BB cream. BB cream's kind of like what I wear more on a day-to-day -day basis just because I think it allows your skin to breathe a bit more. But this is just amazing and I'm a big fan. And then I also have the highlighter as well in the shade Starstruck, which is this gorgeous, 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 gorgeous kind of purpley pearl kind of color. It can be quite blinding, but you can layer it, which is what I really, really like about this one. And then this one is just amazing as well. So those are kind of my two favorite beauty products that I have at the moment. I actually have both of them on right now. So I love, 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 Rihanna did amazing with her Fenty Beauty. Next up, I have a few different items from the drugstore. So for my skincare, I don't really use anything too expensive. I did try a couple of other brands from the more exy kind of price range and it just, my skin broke out and just a number of other things happened. So I was just kind of like, oh, I'll just stick to the old faithful. And my old faithful is Divya. Um, this is the uh, body cream and it's just got the jojoba oil and vitamin E in it and unscented and it's just, it's perfect. I use this because when I fake tan and it just basically helps so that the fake tan can't dry out my skin and it's really quite cold over here and because I think it's just making, drying my skin out so this has been amazing. So that's the first one. And then I've got my day and night cream as well, both for sensitive skin and dry skin. And they're both, the day cream has the SPF 15 and the night cream, they're both unscented and free of perfume and stuff like that. So they're just very, very, very basic, but just so good. And they work so, so well for my skin. And they're not too, they're not too heavy. Like the night cream is a bit heavier, but you can feel it really getting in your skin. And it's just, oh, it's just amazing. I've been using this for years as well is the Cora Organics eye oil. This is incredible. I use this every night. I just roll it under my eyes every night and then I just pat it out. And I feel like it makes such a difference. It reduces puffiness for me. It, it just brightens my under eye and it's just, it's phenomenal. It is the Noni Radiant Eye Oil and this is incredible. It's a bit expensive. I think this cost me like 52 Australian dollars. So it's a bit expensive, but I've had this one for ages now and it's just working so, so well and I'm just, I'm obsessed with it. I'm really sad that it's running out. Like I know it's only half full, but like, I know it's gonna run out soon and then I'm gonna be sad, but that's all good. I go back to Australia soon so I can get another one, which is really good for me. So that's skincare. And that concludes my video for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it kind of gave you a little bit more of an insight as to what I get from writing, fashion, 
skincare, makeup, and I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to see more content like this, please leave a comment below, and I'll see you all next video. Bye!